Hi guys, Kai here and welcome back. This is episode 25 of my FIFA 15 Derby County career on the Xbox One. And we're just changing a few players around to get this episode started. Will Hughes is finally back from his, his injury. And hopefully he gets back into the starting 11 soon. I don't know whether to put him straight in or not. I'm not sure yet. Um, Shaquille McDonald has been playing really well for us when he's been given the chance. He's got some good pace on him, so he's a good backup for Alex and Sonogo right now. Um, Bryson or Thorne? Who should I put Will Hughes in for? It's got to be Thorne, I think. We've got Ibe and Navri on the wings. They're doing a good job for us as well. And let's see who we've got first up today. Who we've got? Oh, we've got Tottenham Hotspur. And they're in third place, I think they are. We're sitting in second, surprisingly. We've got Chelsea on the top, of course. Here we go. Derby County versus Tottenham Hotspurs at the iPro Stadium. Derby County kickoff. And we're attacking with Cyrus Christie on his right side. Can we get an early goal? Hopefully. Alex giving the ball away there. Good challenge from Dembele. Winning the ball for Tottenham. So quiet first half. So we're going to jump straight into the second period. And now we're gone. And Tottenham are on the attack now with Christian Eriksen. Plays it back towards Dembele. He finds Kapue. Ericsson's pushing forward. He's offside now, though. And Dumbia finds Kapue. Shoots, and he's got the first goal of the game. Tottenham lead. 63 minutes gone. Good attacking play there from Tottenham. And into the final minute we go. We're still losing by one goal to nil. Tottenham here with a corner. It's played short. Are they going to stand here and waste time? No. Polina gets across it. Good save from Jack Butland. Keeping the scores at 1-0. Still a chance for Tottenham though to double their lead before the final whistle blows. Christian Eriksen to take it again. I don't think this one's going to be short, is it? Players coming towards it. It might be another short one here by Tottenham. It is indeed. Polino to Eriksen. Back to Polino. And Eric Dyer sets up Kapue. Kapue again. And that is the final whistle. Derby County lose then 1 0. Good play by Tottenham. They deserve the three points, to be fair. And we've got Wigan Athletic next up. This is the Capital One Cup, I believe. We're away from home. And we've both got yellow and blue strips. So we don't want to play that. So here we go. Capital One Cup. Ivy Lane, Wigan Athletic versus Derby County. We lost against Spurs, so we want to get back to winning ways. And hopefully get through to the next round of this trophy. Of this competition, even. So here we go. Wigan on the early attack. On the right side. Watson for Wigan. Good ball. Where's my defence going? He's going to get the cross in here. And header. Volley. Oh, just wide of the post. Not sure who it was that hit that. But it's actually gone out for a corner. Corner to Wigan. Then four minutes gone. Are they going to take an early lead? Cross comes in at the near post. Header. Get it away. Goalkeeper. Oh, no. What the hell just happened? The goalkeeper holds on to the ball, gets pushed over the line somehow, and we are behind then. Wigan lead 1 0. Got, got a minute to go in this first half. And Wigan in possession yet again. Derby County having a really bad day. Having a bad week, to be fair. We lost against Tottenham. And now it looks like we might be losing against Wigan. Twisted the turn, he gets the crossing, headed away. Nice set up there. And the shot. Oh my god. What is happening to Derby County? We've been on such a good run of form recently. And all of a sudden, it's turned to shit. 2-0, we're, lo we're losing then. Oriol Riera. He's the goal scorer for Wigan. Just over an hour played. Still losing by two goals to nil. Derby winning possession. Jordan I playing it forward. Up, but that's going to go out for a throw in. Pert clearing it for Wigan. And Jordan Ives going to take the throw. Finds Forsyth, get the cross in. You've got the space, cross comes in. Sonogo, header over. Yes, Sergio Nabry lobs the keeper with a nicely placed header. And that gives us a chance to get back into this game now. 25 minutes remain. It's Wigan 2, Derby County 1. Sergio Nabry with the, call, with the goal for the Rams. And Sonogo jumping up for it. And somehow find its way to Nabry. And he got the power on it to get over the keeper. So we're going to make a couple of changes. Not got long left. 
the fast McDonald's coming on in place of Alex. Hughes is going to be coming off as well for Jeff Hendrick and Jamie Ward. Shall I take Jamie Ward on or Johnny Russell? Johnny Russell's coming on for Jordan Ives. So last couple of minutes to go in this game. Still losing by two goals to one. I don't know if we're going to have a last chance or not. Wigan are in possession. Come on, we've got to win the ball back now. Oh, lucky. oh, come on. Let's attack. Attack, attack, attack. Jeff Hendrick plays it forward. No, referee. Give me another minute. We could have come back into that. But we're going to get the victory then. A 2-1 win in the Capital One Cup. And that means we are out of this competition. And they go through to the semi-finals of the cup. I didn't even realise that it was the quarter-finals. Chelsea also through to the semis along with Aston Villa and Tottenham Hotspurs as well. And we've got to, I think it's Will Hughes we need to make a new contract for, offer a new contract. He wants more wages, so I'm going to offer him. He is a decent player for us. He's rated overall at 73. He's still a youngster. So I'll try and tie him down for a bit longer, make him happy with some more wages. And who have we got next? Oh, we've got the Arsenal next up. It's going to be a tough one. We've had a bad week so far. Can we get a victory against my favourite club? So here we go. Derby County versus Arsenal. Are we at home or are we playing at the Emirates? We are playing at the Emirates and Arsenal not even in the top seven there. We're still up there though. We need to stay up and try and get the victory. Get back to winning ways. Arsenal versus Derby County. The Emirates Stadium. The rain's falling. It's going to be an evening game. And it's going to be Derby County in their yellow and blue kit to kick this one off. John Ruddy in goal for Arsenal. Murtasaka, Koscielny, Debushi, Kieran Gibbs all at the back still. Flamini, Ramsey. Joel Campbell's playing as well. Cochrane. Why is Cochrane playing? Rasik is still at Arsenal. Danny Welbeck up front as well. So 20 minutes almost played. And Arsenal with a goal kick playing it short to Koscielny. Pushing forward on his left side. Joel Campbell's playing on the left side. Good play there from Serge Navry, former Arsenal player. He's won the ball and he's going to go all the way. Can he score on his return to the Emirates? Good save from the keeper, but he's there with the rebound. And Serge Navry, the former Arsenal midfielder, has given Derby County a one-goal lead. Good play from him. He's probably trying to make a mark and prove a point to the Arsenal fans and manager that he is a good player. And that's his second goal of the league so far. Corner to Arsenal, cross comes in. Good play there from Jack Butland, holding on to it well. Throwing it out, a chance here for a counter-attack maybe for Derby. No, Alex has lost out there to Flamini, who's running down the wing himself. Plays it in, in field to Cochrane, plays it forward and beating at the near post. Jack Butland won't be happy with that. It's Danny Welbeck who slid in, got his boot on it and equalises for the Arsenal. Half an hour gone, it's Arsenal 1, Derby County 1. Good play from Flamini and then a nice ball from Cochrane. And good finish, I guess. Third goal of the Premiership for Danny Welbeck as we go into the second period. Derby County have a goal kick. Taken short to Christie, who's given it away to Thomas Rosicki. And he plays it forward. Get a nice one too. Thomas Rosicki has scored and given, Derby, uh, given Arsenal a 2 1 lead. And I'm just looking for my phone because it's just beeped. I found it. There we go. We'll ignore Arsenal taking the lead. My bloody phone's going off. Thomas Rossicki then with the goal for Arsenal. A minute to go. Arsenal on the attack again. Looking for a third. Kieran Gibbs plays it forward to Flamini. Now Gibbsy. Oh, that's a poor shot from Kieran Gibbs. Should have made it 3-1 there to Arsenal, but it looks like they're going to get the victory anyway. And this is going to be our third loss in a row after the good form we've been on. We've had an absolutely dreadful week. Hopefully next episode, next week, we will be getting back to winning ways and getting back to the top. Where we, oh, we're currently sitting second, but we are now six point, no, five points behind Chelsea, who sit top. Spurs right behind us with a game in hand as well. They can overtake us. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like the video, please hit like, comment if you want to below, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Peace.